Hi, my name is Bianca. I'm 24 years old and I am a student at SFU um, studying education and I'm finishing my teaching program soon to become a French immersion teacher here in BC. I was placed in Tonnet, uh, which is in the Burgundy region of France, a very small town, very different from um, where I've, I was coming from in Canada. And it was uh, really interesting to get off the train like as if I was in a Harry Potter movie and just walk around in a very small town and get to know it over the seven months. It was, it was a really interesting place, very, very small, but I think it it was just, it was the change I needed in my life. I chose France because uh, I wanted to challenge myself uh, linguistically. I had been studying French for uh, some time, but only in the academic setting. So I wanted to uh, challenge myself to uh, step out of my comfort zone and speak French and live it in, on an everyday basis. I loved it. It was at times uh, a little bit nerve-wracking. I wasn't used to ordering food, for example, in French, but it was, it was really fun. One of my fondest memories was uh, Friendsgiving. It was an evening I spent in chalon sur saone with some of the assistants from l'Académie de Dijon, and uh, it was just a night of comfort food, good vibes, community, and it was really nice to celebrate one of my favorite holidays with my new chosen family abroad. Branch out, reach other, uh, meet other people at orientation. I met some of my closest friends there and um, I'm still in contact with them. So I think that it's important to meet other people from other countries. You're gonna meet so many cool um, assistants and um, yeah, just step out of your comfort zone and don't be shy. Speak as much French as you can and um, get to know other people from around the world.